All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game, One Live. My name is Typo, and this is Elden Ring Part 89. And today, we are going to be doing Gelmir Hero's Grave. Um, we've seen some very differing difficulty levels from the Hero Graves. We've seen a very hard one and a very doable one. So we'll see what kind of Hero's Grave this ends up being. Let's start with the phalanx and let's get going. We just hit level 122, I think. Yeah, last time we just hit 122. I think I want to put two more levels in vigor and then we'll start raising strength and endurance again. I need to go slow because I am going blind as a bat into this area. I got no idea what I'm looking at. Kind of has Volcano Manor-esque color scheme to it though, doesn't it? That's going to be a hidden passageway. There's no way it's not. Oh god, are we doing this again? Wait, is that not a hidden path? It's not, because there's gonna be a wheeled thing again. Oh god. It is, isn't it? It is gonna be a wheeled thing again. Oh. <laughs> no! Okay, I gotta go to that side thing right there. There it is, I see it. Got him. <laughs> Alright. How are we going to do this now? Also, hate the skeletons for trying that, by the way. Screw them. What is this? What? And I can't teleport out. This feels like I'm trapped trapped. Like, where do you even go from here? What am I missing? There, there's no way out of this. What am I missing? I'm so confused. I almost just have to like escape back up the hill, kind of? Maybe I'll try that. That's pretty far though. I'm dead. I'm actually dead. Oh my god, I'm alive! Oh my god, we got hit but didn't die? What? Since when is that possible? Oh my god. When our character made that, like, I got hit sound, I was like, no way we just died again. My heart just started pumping. What is that? What do we do here? God, that is... Jesus Christ, that is a lot. That's it? That's like... <laughs> Oh my god! Am I just supposed to take the hit? Oh no. No, this is a mess right here. And I can't just attack this, can I? Pretty sure I can't just attack this. But let me try it. Boy, I got no idea how we're supposed to handle this one. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if that did anything. Son of a bitch, dude. <laughs> I don't think it's doing anything. Um. Wow. Actually, have no idea. I might hit the grace just to reset it. But then, even then, what do you do? You know. There might be a cut in the audio, or a cut in the audio, cut in the video if I can't figure something out here. I'm really, really baffled. It's good that we can survive the hit, so that's good. I could force our way through with like an aromatic, you know what I mean? Like spray one of these aromatics on us every time it's about to hit us and kind of force our way through that way, I suppose. Man, I really don't know. But it's looking really rough. Let me reset it a grace. Get the thing reset. Unless it doesn't reset. And then... Then I'm extra worried. But I'm gonna be honest. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing with that. Is it back down at the bottom at least? 
What the? How do you... What? You don't want to fall in the lava. Lava will kill you, obviously. What am I missing here? What am I not understanding? I mean, I can try going the other way. I just don't know how well that would even begin to work. Probably have Carrion Slicer ready for being real. It does a lot of damage as fast as possible to the skeletons and stuff. And yeah, I could use an aromatic to just avoid the hit from one of these shots. I'm assuming blocking the cart is not an option. Okay, let me... Let me try this again. Let me try this again. Let me go down to this, where the... Skeletons are. Yeah. Okay. Now they're dead. And then it's... It's gonna keep doing that thing. Let me use an aromatic. So that we can survive getting hit, I guess. What the hell is this? This is some weird stuff, I tell ya. Oh, we didn't look at our weapons and our new pots and stuff like that earlier. My bad. Okay. Just go. Oh, God. Okay, I didn't see this. Good, 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 good. Okay, got it. I got it. I got it. Okay, I get it. Alright, I, I totally didn't see this earlier. Okay. Oh, stop. Okay, hold up. I'm getting it now. Alright, and then it goes all the way down there. Okay, I just had to commit a little more. I hadn't committed enough. Waste of an aromatic, but it's not the end of the world. Okay. So I see another opening there on the left. I'll commit to that. Hello, hello? Oh my good god. What was... What was that Darth Sidious skeleton dive there? Did you see that? Oh my god. <laughs> he jumped out of there like Darth Sidious from the Star Wars movie. That was crazy. Alright, so at one of the hero's graves, there was like a drop down here. I need to see if I can find one there. Didn't expect skeleton. I expected a skeleton, but that man did some weird stuff. Okay. Oh, uh, I bet you could drop down onto that. I bet you could. I bet you have to, because there's just lava at the end of that. Interesting. So we need to have an accurate fall, too. Not just any fall. Hmm. Let me read that message over there, see what it says. Alright, this is gonna be another one of those hero graves like the first one. The second hero's grave was so easy. And I really enjoyed how easy that was. Yeah, you can kinda get on that side thing there, huh? Let's go down to the other side, I guess. See if there's a better way down from there. Okay. Help me, oh help me. There's also a thing right there. Okay. Dude, this is crazy. Let me just drink up. Yeah, there's, there's no reason not to. Go, 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 go! Oh! 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 I didn't have to jump down to that other area. There's also an area down there. Oh my god, wait a minute! This place is crazy. Be wary of left. Alright. I can do that. Alright, these enemies are not worth a comet spell, but... This guy might be. Okay, good. Got him. There's another one up there. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. There, there's another one right there. Oh, 
come on. I was about to say, please reach. <laughs> Just reach, please. Okay, Glove War at six and sevens are pretty good. All right, a little love tap for me there. I don't mind that. Whoa, I swung over the man. That's a new problem. <laughs> All right, cool, cool, cool. Okay, another one of those, huh? Let me set up another Phalanx. You know I love them. Gotta have them. Uh, might be a waste down here. Be wary of right. Yeah, it's just a normal dude though. Let me, let me hit this guy up here first. Place of the phalanx there. Idiot. <laughs> Loser. <laughs> he thought he was slick. Aristocrat, aristocrat garb altar. Well, now, we, now let me go down here for a bit. Hold up. There's a guy on the right. Yep. Grave glove wart six. Grave glove wart seven. The amount of glove wart in here, pretty unreal. Loving it. Loving it. You know, I can make a good profit all those extra glove warts. I'm assuming that doesn't reach to the left here, but I should probably just hit that, huh? Hmm. Rather than waste magic. Let me bring out the old faithful ranged weapon here. Our favorite black key crossbow. And then next time the fire goes by, I'm going to shoot at that, and that'll make it go down. Oh my god. Let me actually aim it this next time. Oh no, am I using the valuable bolts? Oh, Jesus. That was a waste of two Scarlet Rot bolts. Bolts. That was a weird way to say that. Damn. My bad. That's not ideal, to be honest. Oh shit! Let me <laughs> let me trade let me trade this back to the actual weapon we want to be using. Uh, there it is. Okay, I'm not seeing anything there at the moment. No reason to get on this thing, I don't think. I hear movement over here, but I think it's just this guy. Which isn't much. What were you doing there, dude? There was some fire really near this. We already have left all the more be wary of right. Okay, so double ambush is what you're saying. I'll be ready. Oh, Jesus. Nah, that's, that's like extra. Okay, rude. Oh, okay. I didn't need that second one. Oh, well. He's shooting the wall. What a genius. Oh. I mean, if he's gonna stand back there, I'll, I'll let him. Two slashes with the sword is not bad. Okay. Alright. I still hear those footsteps somewhere beyond these walls, but all right. Using a lot of FP here. Don't like that. Be wary of decoy. Be wary of trap. All right, awesome. Back to this. Here again. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Here again. Okay. <laughs> we could go down. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. We're back to this again. And this way, there was that one area. But I don't know if we actually would want to go there, you know? But it makes its way over, yeah. 
Is there a reason I want to go to that right there? I just don't know. And if I did that, would I be able to get back up here without dying is the question. But I, I have to try. I can't just ignore it. Oh shit. Oh god. That's really bad. It was pointless. Oh no. That's so bad. That's actually so bad. I'm definitely getting hit doing this. Shit. Let me get another aromatic. I'm, d I'm definitely taking a lick here. This is gonna hurt. Oh no, I wasted it on the lava. Oh my god. I'm gonna get so lit up right here. Oh my god, no I'm not. Oh wow. Alright. I've wasted two aromatics in here just because I, I didn't fully understand what I was getting myself into. Whoops. I really thought that was gonna catch us quicker. How many more aromatics can I make? Like, how, how like, safe do I have to be on this? Let's take a look at these pots, by the way. Uh, lightning pot. Here we are. Throw enemies at, enemy, throw at enemies to inflict lightning damage. Vulgar bloom and mushrooms. Boy, we can make as many of those as we want, really, because vulgar blooms also spawn a lot in those, like, lightning areas. Mushrooms we find all the time. Okay. And then volcano pots. Creates heat cloud, causing continuous fire damage. And all it takes is two volcanic stones. Oh yeah, I'm making three of both of those. We're gonna try those out. Shit, I might even make more than three. Like, we have so many extra, but I don't know. Let me let me test them out, I guess. We have 99 volcanic stones? Why did I pick up that many? It's even more than I thought I picked up. Okay, let me get a look at this. There's absolutely nowhere to go up. Let me grab that glove ore, and then we'll turn around. And then there is a way down. So I can start going as soon as it starts turning around. Actually, you can fit through this little crack. Here we go. Go, go, go. Saw that coming. Ha <laughs> ha. Get him. Ah, it's not going to get him. No way. You're kidding me. <laughs> That's so unfortunate. All right, that'll do it. Come on, really? All right. I'm assuming these guys just got comp like combined skeleton and carriage thing. Chariot. We still didn't jump down to that one area, but that one area jump down is like so close to the grace that like if I really want to do it and I feel like there's no other way to get there, then we can just do it from the grace later. Yeah, wow, there's there's not much room, is there? Not jumping down there. What the? We go to the other side, I guess. Try right except down. Yeah, okay. I was hoping, because the left wasn't looking good. No, I don't like that either. But I, I see it, I think. I think I saw it. It still looks pretty bad. Okay. Right there. Oh, I gotta go pretty far, actually. Oh my god, that's awful. And it's a thin strip of land, too. That's no joke. Oh my god. This... Jesus, this is gonna be... This is gonna be the area we get our seventh death. I'm telling you right now. This is gonna be so bad. Oh my god. This... Yeah, this sucks. Here we go. Oh! That was so close. Okay, I need a phalanx up. I need to be protected from, like, some random bullshit. Okay, no, it actually looks like we're through. Tunnel ahead. Oh, that was also on this side. Okay. Oh, boy. <laughs> that was not pretty. But we're alive. Let me get Slicer out. Like, I need to be able to defend myself until I get somewhat safe. Okay. Actually, I can go... Okay. Okay. 
Okay. All right. Try guard counter. What do we got behind here? Some an actual decent enemy here. Ooh, the what the? Yeah, it looks pretty big. All right. Try guard counter. How about I try blowing him up? How much FP I got? Seventy-seven. So I have enough for three comets, but not enough for a dark moon. Fair enough. Here we go. Oh, yes. Oh, it was a Bloodhound Knight. Okay. Those guys must be so tough in melee, because that's not the first time. Oh, didn't expect armor, then armor. Yeah, Bloodhound Knight, full gear. Damn, okay. And full Gelmir Knight armor. What the? Armor, then <laughs> behold armor. True. Oh my god, we just got two armor sets. Where's that curved sword we found earlier? So I can look at that too. Scavenger's curved sword. Blood loss build up 45 DD. Unique curved sword knots like shark's teeth. Yeah, that looks like it would mess you up. Weapon carved by corpse villagers who prowl the sites of old battles. The blade is tacky with blood and covered in heavy nicks, making it totally uneven. Life can be sinister indeed. Wow, there's not usually a lot of joke sentences at the end there. The spitting slash, okay. And then the armor, um, the scaled helm is pretty, the scaled helm is even heavier than our current helmet. No, not the imp one though, the imp one is still heavier. Bloodhound Knight and Gelmir Knight look like they're kind of mid-range armors maybe? God, the Bloodhound Knight helm looks so stupid, I hate it. Looks so dumb. Rodan's line armor, scaled armor is like on par with the Crucible Tree armor, pretty insane. Gelmir and Bloodhound armor seems mid-range. High in robustness, kind of the same, same thing as the Crucible Tree armor, just worse. Cool though. I mean, if you were looking for new armor sets to wear, there's two right here, which is kind of sick. Oh, get it. Didn't expect armor and then armor. Yeah, fair. We've only gotten ten thousand runes exploring this place. I mean, that's probably a lot considering how little things we've actually fought. But I don't know, man. These hero graves are always a lot of work. I dig it. Root resin times five. Oh, please tell me this is where I think it is. I really sincerely hope that this is... Oh, there go my phalanxes. There's a doorway we can use. Okay. This isn't underneath that one area, is it? I don't think so. I think this is its own area. Let me go to the other side here. Okay. Wow, that thing goes on a whole trip. Wow, that was slow. Took its time. <laughs> oh, God. Just get me on the wooden beam, please. That's what I wanted. Okay, here we are. This is! This is the wooden beams, I think, from the beginning! We did find a way over here. That's awesome. Good, 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 good. Yeah, because we were going down here, and I was like, oh, there are wooden beams, I guess, that we could drop down onto. That's pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie. Pretty exciting. Oh, they died jumping in there? That tells me a lot of very valuable information, actually. I like that. What's- there's a lot of blood pools in there, yeah. Did you die jumping in there too? No, you, you jumped into the wagon, you idiot. What was that? Okay, yeah, they jumped down from above, right? I'm so glad that this all connected. And then he went over there, or what? I think it could probably go there if it wanted to. There's going to be an enemy right here. There's no way there's not, right? Otherwise, why would anything have died here? Alright, as soon as it turns around, let's go. Yep, a cemetery shade. Wow. Screw... Mantis Blade, hell yeah. Dude, screw that guy. 
What is he doing there? Oh, man. That's kind of crazy. Let me get that Grave Lily or whatever it is afterwards. That is actually kind of crazy. Oh, I love Carrion Phalanx. It's so disgustingly good. They didn't balance it in the best way. <laughs> Wait, hold up. Is this where I just jumped from? Figure it out. That is, that's where I just was. If I go there, will it let me go down that way? This thing goes on a whole trip. I, I don't think I can go that way. Uh, what do I do here exactly? Let me look at this. No, that all looks not really doable. If I'm being honest. Now what? Dude, these hero graves are super cool, but they're also a lot of work. Because, in, in a good way. I, I The way I said that made it sound like it was a negative. No. I love how in-depth these hero graves are. Because they make me think. They make me work for it. They are, they're all very unique. Like, even though I've seen these horse chariot things before, the, the way we have to tackle them is a lot different. I still can't believe that one didn't kill us earlier. Okay, I double checked. That is definitely not something we can do. So I gotta go back up? But for why and to where? Oh, was it because it was too close before I had to go the other way? Maybe. Um, let's make a run for it after it runs away, I guess? And see what we can get to? I might be for I might be forgetting the actual details here, but all we can do is try. Run, Casper. Just book it. Just go, Casper. Just go. That's right. We couldn't get up before. Now we can. Good, good. A stone sword key? That's what I got for my time? Oh, no. I die here? Oh, my God. Go. Go, Casper. Oh, my God. We survived that. What the? Dude, we are so tanky, actually. Since when can we just survive stuff like that? Um. Now what? We've gone, like, every way I can think of. But we haven't found a lever or a boss room yet. This is really strange. really strange. And the magma makes you walk around. Like, you can't even, like, run in the magma. It locks you down. Yeah, there's, there's no way. Yeah. Okay. Did I miss anything over here, maybe? Let me put the lantern on, just in case it helps. What am I missing? What's... Alright, so you're probably coming back here after a cut. I've been trying to figure this place out for... I'm not kidding, 30 minutes. I can't find where we haven't gone. And I can hear back at the Grace this, like, scarab sound. But I can't figure out where it is, how to get to it. I don't know how I'm supposed to move forward in this place. This is the first place that's truly stumped me, to be honest. Um. I gotta take a break. I, I've i spent, like, it's been almost an hour I've been recording. And I just, I can't figure it out. So I'm gonna call this recording here. I'm probably just, I don't know if this will be the end of an episode or if I'll tape another session onto this one. Either way, dude, this place has got me stumped beyond belief. It's crazy. I can't figure this place out. It's insane. 
I, what am I missing here? I just, I don't know. If this is the end of an episode, I, it, nah, I'll probably tape one on here. I don't know. This, I am stumped though. All right. Okay. It's a, it's a brand new day and I'm back for more Elden Ring. And I've gone through this place a few times now. If you look at 28,000 golden runes, I've done a couple trips trying to figure this place out. And I think, watch this blood stain right here. I, do you see that? This man is basically riding there's like a square back to this thing. And I'm, I, I probably sound way overly excited, but I have been here for so long. Let me, we're over 58 hours into Casper, dude. I don't know when the last time I showed our playtime on the channel was, but I have spent well over an hour in this dungeon at this point. Just, I could not for the life of me figure out where I needed to go next. Now, I don't know what kills him, though. Do I need to be on the alert for something? Because he clearly... He, like, dies when he jumps on it, though. I don't know. Never mind. Maybe not. I, I gotta try it, though. I, I, I'm really at a complete loss for what to do next. I can't, I can't figure this place out. Try down, but behold, Cavalier. That's what I'm saying, like... Maybe he jumped on a little late? I don't know. I'm gonna say good. I wish this message was here last time. I just couldn't figure this out last time. And if this doesn't do it, I am just beyond baffled. And that would also explain why this guy does this, like, really slow slowdown. You know how the other, like... Um, we'll call them cavalier things, I guess. The other, like, cavalier things, like, go real fast. And then they turn around on a dime. These guys are going really slow. And I thought that was weird, but I didn't chalk it up to anything more than being a little weird. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my God! Oh, shit! That's so cool! I gotta go here. Oh, my God. Don't kill me, please. I'm, I'm just gonna stand here. Okay, it doesn't look like we slide off or anything. Oh, oh my god, dude. This is so cool. This is so cool. Oh my god. There, okay, there is like a ladder there we can use. <laughs> Finally! I've been in this... Oh god, these hero graves are so good. I was a little bored and frustrated, obviously, because I couldn't figure it out, but that's... That's just a me issue that I couldn't figure it out. Oh god. That's not good. Yep, that's not good. Yep, that's not good. Speaking of me not being good, uh, I should have done that on the way back, not where I just did that. What the hell was I thinking? Jesus Christ. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. That was so much health gone, wasted. At least we survived it. Imagine, but that was so dumb. All right, well, here we are. Oh no! Did I miss a lever somewhere? No, I didn't, okay. Oh, don't tell me this is the, like, the fight's run. It, okay, hold up. I was like, don't start right away though. Don't be like a boss fight immediately. Oh my God, progress, dude. That feels so good. There's the boss room. Gotta make sure I actually get to the boss room though first. I hear footsteps. I still don't know where that scarab sounding thing was. I look okay. Man, do I have the resources for this? I got pretty good at clearing out the area. I did it a few times, but I was still taking some hits. And then of course I went and messed it up pretty hard at the end there. Um, I think I'll use an aromatic just cause we're going in with so few heals, you know? Oh, thank God, thank God. I was going to be like, no. Okay. All right. I'll probably start with a phalanx and a mimic tier. Yeah. 
don't die now. Just don't, just... Don't die now. I, I could get back here fairly easily if I needed to, but I've already cleared this place out like three times. Let's not have to do it again, please. Okay. Alright. Okay. Alright. Okay. Here we go. Whew. Flask of Wondrous Physic up. I'll probably have to heal again because of the Mimic tier if it lets me. Here we go. It does? Oh, it's another red wolf, dude. These hurts. I have two heals for a red wolf. At least I have Mimic tier this time. Okay. Go ahead, Mimic tier. Do your thing. Nice. A 306 from the Mimic tier is nice. Okay. I know this is really cowardly, but I've got two heals. And, uh... To be honest, I'll take being cowardly right now. Here we go. Let's try out Ronnie's Dark Moon. Oh my god, the damage. Oh boy, oh boy. Is he still on the Mimic tier? No way. Wait, I could just let Mimic tier finish this. I mean, that's kind of lame, but... Look at that. I got it. Could have let him do it, but I'll get involved. That one was definitely easier than the one Blood Knight, Bloodhound Knight Flow. All right, that was definitely easier than the Red Wolf at the Moonlight Altar. I think that Moonlight Altar was really high level, just me personally. I was kind of expecting another Tree Spirit to be honest. Okay, and a Death Root. Okay, so we got that for Garak next time. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and slap this on the last recording. Thank God we figured it out. I spent so much time in this dungeon, but I I was frustrated. I'm not going to lie and say I wasn't. I'm sure you heard it in my voice several times. Whatever I leave in the cut, but it was very fun and very unique. So most of it came down to me not being very smart, and that's just fair enough. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider giving a like. If you really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. But either way, thank you so much. For joining Casper and I on this journey in Elden Ring. Next time, we'll continue our travels in Mount Gelmir and see if we can get to that item real quick. How would you even get to that? Not from over here. You gotta do that from over there. So, yeah, I'll see y'all next time. Let's go, Casper.